SKS Microfinance audit report shows that the company witnessed a financial frauds to the tune of about 2 crores this year. This includes cash embezzlement, loans to non-existing borrowers and misappropriation of cash by external parties. Sunanda has uh, been going through that report and is now joining us with more details. Sunanda, tell us. Well, it's definitely not looking good. The auditors in the annual report have said that, you know, like you're pointing out, uh, the cross uh, to the tune of two, uh, you know, uh, two crores of uh, fraud has been committed uh, by the company of which cash uh, embezzlements amount to almost uh, one and a half crores. They're also saying that loans to non-existent borrowers uh, is to almost uh, 83 lakhs and misappropriation, not just by internal parties, but also by uh, external third parties is to the tune of 4.5 lakhs. Now, what we understand is that SKS on its part is saying that it has set up a committee that an investigation is in process and that employees uh, who have been involved in this fraud have been terminated. A quick note, we also understand, and this is from a report from Minte, saying that it is very likely that the MFI bill, which was to be taken up in the winter session of parliament, could possibly get delayed. This is because there are several roadblocks and those are not likely uh, to be dealt with and cleared before the winter session of parliament ends on the 20th. And therefore, uh, again, and this is uh, for the sixth year in a row that the MFI bill is being put off, it seems likely that there could be no clarity on that.